Hi everyone, so I wanted to share with you a neat thing I came up with. I got these at the Dollar Tree. I'll show you those in a minute, but the pages from there make great, um, just pages that you put in your planner, journal, to remind you throughout the day, little bits of encouragement, um, quotes, wisdom, scriptures. It's just, I just, uh, I thought that was so neat. And uh, I'll share this more in another video. I just started using this kind of a planner. So, let me check and make sure this is still in. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> okay, so I got these at the Dollar Tree, like I said. I got five of them. This first one is Grace as a Gift. And it's the size of my hand, so it will fit. Once you trim the, the number on the bottom and, this, and the side, it, it'll fit in most planners. Just depends on how you punch it or insert it into your planner. So this one is grace and is blue. It's probably my favorite one just because of the blue coloring, kind of a periwinkle. But you have quotes like this one from Thomas Watson. Does, does God give us a Christ and will he deny us a crust? If God does not give us what we crave, he will give us what we need. Thomas Watson. Being justified by his faith, we should be made heirs according to the hope of eternal life. Titus 3.7. So it's just the, the whole thing. There's 40 pages in each book. And you got scripture passages and wisdom from notable people throughout history. There's a lot of wisdom and encouragement. Throughout many dangerous toils and snares I have already come. Tis grace, tis grace hath brought me safe thus far, and grace will lead me home by John Newton. Just so many of those. And it's just this one is just so pretty with the blues and kind of periwinkle colors. So there's that one. That's grace as a gift. This one is words of faith. Every other set of pages have butterflies. These are a teal color. And don't you just love that teal with the white, white polka dots? So this one, and they all have pretty much the same. They have quotes and poems and passages and lots, at least probably half the pages are, are scripture. I think this one here has a little less scripture than the other, but there's still scripture in there. This Ephesians 1, 3. So you have the butterflies. Every other page is the butterflies and every other page, every other spread is the polka dots. But this this one is what, um, this book with the polka dots is what inspired me. And then when I started looking at the other ones, I thought, whoa, that's for a dollar. You have 40 pages. And what's neat is every, it, there's something on every page. So if you punch it and put it in your planner, there's something on each page. It isn't like something there and then a white page. So these two here, Let Hope Arise and Friendship, would be good for this time of year because of the orange kind of an orange so people may consider apricot but it's a nice and fall fall look you got the leaves and the flowers there in the background but so there's that one let hope rise and he, there's this one's about hope this one was has friendship in it this one has faith passages and this one is grace so they follow through throughout the book on the title based on the title. So this one it has a seascape, orange on one spread. The next one is this vertical uh, diagonal stripes and then go back to the seascapes. So again every other spread we got scripture and wisdom. This one reminds me of my mom. I think I'm going to take a few of these out and um, trim them up and put them on her give them to her to do what she wants to with when I see her at the nursing home probably tomorrow. She has Alzheimer's, but she loves roses and makes me think of her. Maybe I'll go out and buy a, another one of these and just give the whole thing to my mom. But I'll think of her as I put these in my planner. You'll put these in your planner, your journal, post them in your mirror, <laughs> anything you want to do because for a dollar you get, can get so much use out of this. So this one is roses on one spread. 
and then just two roses on each corner on the other spread. And then it alternates back and forth like that. But just how cool is that? Just take whatever punch you use for whatever plannery or system you use, punch it, trim the trim the page numbers off and trim the sides and punch it and there you go. Just a little tip from me and my planner buddies. Have a great day everyone.